Hello everyone and welcome back to Project Luxury. New York and New Jersey, in collaboration with Amtrak, have embarked on a monumental endeavor to rescue the Northeast Corridor train line, a critical lifeline of transportation in the United States. This ambitious multi-billion dollar construction initiative aims not only to enhance the existing infrastructure, but also to expand and future-proof this essential passenger railroad system. The urgency of this project is underscored by the age of the infrastructure, which has surpassed a century, and the deteriorating state of affairs that demands immediate attention. Recognizing the imperative nature of the situation, stakeholders are mobilizing with determination and strategic planning to address this long-standing challenge that has plagued the corridor. The ultimate objective is clear, to execute necessary improvements swiftly and efficiently, revitalizing this vital transportation artery for current and future generations. This comprehensive effort reflects a commitment to ensuring the functionality, reliability, and efficiency of the Northeast Corridor for years to come, reinforcing the pivotal role in facilitating movement and connectivity across the nation. The Northeast Corridor, renowned as the busiest railway network in the United States, faces a critical challenge as it reaches its maximum capacity due to outdated infrastructure and the constraints imposed by century-old tunnels. This vital transportation artery serves as a lifeline for New York commuters and freight transportation, facilitating essential movement and commerce. However, the corridor's functionality was severely tested by the devastating impact of Hurricane Sandy in 2012. The storm's floodwaters inundated the North River tunnels with corrosive salt water, resulting in widespread damage to crucial electrical systems, tracks, and signaling equipment. The aftermath of Hurricane Sandy served as a wake-up call, underscoring the urgent need for a comprehensive overhaul of the Northeast Corridor. In response to this pressing need, the Gateway Program emerged as a visionary initiative aimed at revolutionizing trans-Hudson transportation. Unveiled in 2011 after the cancellation of the Access to the Region's core project, the Gateway Program embarked on an ambitious mission to address the corridor's vulnerabilities head-on. Central to the Gateway's project's initiatives are its extensive plan to modernize and expand critical infrastructure. These plans encompass construction of new rail bridges in the New Jersey Meadowlands, the creation of tunnels beneath Bergen Hill and the Hudson River, the rehabilitation of the existing 1910 tunnel, and the expansion of New York's iconic Penn Station. These initiatives are designed to alleviate congestion, enhance efficiency, and improve overall service reliability. The pressing need for the Gateway Program is underscored by the limitations of the current infrastructure, particularly evident in the corridor's two-track configuration. As rail traffic continues to grow and evolve, it has become increasingly clear that the Northeast Corridor requires a comprehensive and forward-thinking approach to ensure its continued viability and effectiveness in meeting the region's transportation needs. Thus, the Gateway Program represents a crucial step towards modernizing and future-proofing one of the nation's most critical transportation arteries. The North River Tunnels, limited to 24 trains per hour, create a bottleneck hindering movement between two heavily populated states. The Gateway Program aimed not only to refurbish these aging tunnels, but also to double the corridor's train capacity, facilitating increased high-speed rail service and ensuring economic vitality for generations to come. Initially, securing funding and political backing for such an extensive project posed challenges, with nearly a decade passing before significant progress was achieved. However, the urgency highlighted by Hurricane Sandy's devastation acted as a catalyst garnering federal and state support. By 2021, the Gateway Program had attained formal approval from the federal government, with an estimated cost of $16.1 billion. This marked the commencement of a new phase of the Northeast Corridor's transformation. The construction and engineering phase of the Gateway Program exemplifies modern infrastructure development, featuring innovative solutions, meticulous planning, and a forward-thinking approach. At its core lies the construction of new rail tunnels beneath the Hudson River, representing a monumental endeavor in overcoming engineering challenges and paving the way for a more connected and efficient future for the Northeast Corridor. The tunnel construction process commences with the use of tunnel boring machines, or TBMs, marvels of engineering designed to excavate the earth with precision. Equipped with cutting-edge technology, these machines navigate through various geological conditions beneath the river, ensuring the tunnel's path is both efficient and safe. Guided by advanced GPS and laser systems, TBMs make real-time adjustments to avoid obstacles and maintain the correct trajectory as they carve through the earth. A precast concrete lining stabilizes the newly formed tunnel, ensuring its integrity and longevity. Another crucial aspect of the Gateway Program is the replacement of the Portal Bridge, a notorious bottleneck for rail traffic. The proposed design features a Portal Bridge replacement, a higher fixed-span bridge that eliminates the need for openings, thereby reducing delays. This structure is engineered to withstand the test of time, utilizing robust materials and construction techniques. Innovative methods such as off-site manufacturing of bridge components minimize disruption to existing rail service, showcasing efficiency and foresight. 
Additionally, the Tunnel Avenue Bridge and Utility Relocation Project, a vital preliminary step in Hudson Tunnel construction, involves shifting a significant roadway to accommodate future tunnel tracks. Executed in phases to maintain traffic flow, this project includes temporary relocations of utilities and roadways to ensure uninterrupted access. It also encompasses significant site work, such as grading, drainage, and stormwater management, highlighting a comprehensive approach to infrastructure development. The Gateway Program also addresses the challenges of integrating new infrastructure with Manhattan's bustling urban environment, particularly at Hudson Yards. The Penn Station expansion at Hudson Yards stands as a testament to innovative problem-solving in addressing the challenges of urban development and transportation infrastructure. At its core, the construction of a tunnel box beneath Hudson Yards preserves the right-of-way for future tunnels while allowing the development of commercial and residential spaces above ground. This approach showcases precision engineering, ensuring the structural integrity of both the tunnel infrastructure and the buildings erected atop it. A key aspect of the program's vision is the expansion of Penn Station, a critical transportation hub that serves as a gateway to New York City and the Northeast Corridor. By adding new tracks, platforms, and passenger concourses, the expansion aims to significantly enhance the station's capacity to accommodate the growing demand for rail transportation. With approximately 1,300 train movements daily, Penn Station has long been identified as a bottleneck in the Northeast Corridor, and its expansion is crucial to improving the efficiency and reliability of rail travel in the region. The Sawtooth Bridge Replacement Project is another pivotal component of the program, aiming to modernize these distinctive bridges that are integral to the rail network. By accommodating four tracks, the new bridges will seamlessly integrate with the expanded throughput of the Northeast Corridor, facilitating smoother and more efficient rail operations. Furthermore, the Harrison Forth Track Project addresses the need for additional capacity by relocating path traffic and signaling equipment to make room for an additional track. This strategic move not only enhances the corridor's capacity to handle increased train and passenger volumes, but also improves overall service reliability and resilience. In summary, the Penn Station expansion at Hudson Yards alongside the Sawtooth Bridge Replacement and Harrison Fourth Track Project represents a comprehensive effort to modernize and expand critical transportation infrastructure in the Northeast Corridor. These initiatives are essential for meeting the growing demand for rail travel, improving connectivity, and ensuring the region's economic vitality for years to come. The Gateway Program pledges to replace the Dock Bridge over the Passaic River in Newark, aiming to transform it from a movable to a fixed structure. This overhaul seeks to alleviate delays experienced by PATH NJ Transit and Amtrak trains, with a repairs plan for its aged steel and concrete components. This nearly 90-year-old bridge will continue to play a vital role in the region's transportation network. Additionally, the Portal South Bridge project will introduce a second two-track bridge over the Hackensack River, aligning with the Northeast Corridor's four-track standard to enhance rail traffic flow. Track expansion and reconfiguration at Secaucus Junction are crucial for supporting the Gateway Program's service growth. Furthermore, the introduction of the bergen secaucus Loop promises seamless one-seat rides for NJ Transit and MTA Metro North riders, directly connecting them to Penn Station, New York. Anticipating increased rail service, a new NJ Transit storage yard is in the works to ensure sufficient operational logistics support. The Gateway Program's innovative approach and ambitious plans are reshaping the future of rail travel, promising smoother, quicker, and more dependable journeys across the Northeast Corridor. Share your thoughts on the potential impact of the Gateway Program on future travel and infrastructure in America in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and enable notifications to stay updated with our latest videos.